Hello everyone. Uh, welcome to the video on ornamental fishes. I am Dr. B. Danalakshmi, Assistant Professor, Department of Zoology, Nirmala College for Women. In this video, we are going to see about variety of ornamental fishes and their types. Welcome to the world of commercial ornamental fishes. I am here to talk about commercial in ornamental fishes. Inland and marine water in India possesses a rich diversity of ornamental fishes. The Western Ghats of India is one of the 34 biodiversity hotspot areas of the world. Indian ornamental fish trade mostly deals with freshwater fish of 90% of which 98% are cultured. Fishes that are kept in home aquariums or for aesthetic purposes are considered to be ornamental fishes. Ornamental fishes are usually kept in tanks or other aquarium systems. These fishes encompass a wide variety of species of many shapes, size and colors. Today, I'm here to talk about few commercial fishes. Goldfish, which is scientifically called as Heracius auratus. The common name of the fish is goldfish or fan tail. It belongs to the habitat of fresh water. The optimum temperature in which it grows is falls between 17 to 28 degrees. The pH of the water should be between 7.5 to 8.5. It attains a maximum size of 59 centimeter. It feeds on dry food and large variety of feed. Basically, they are omnivores. The biology of goldfish is that if it does not have stomach, it lays egg and it also eats for 20 years. The next ornamental fish which we are going to discuss is about angelfish. The scientific name is Tyrophyllum scalare. The common name is angelfish. It lives in freshwater habitat. The optimum temperature is 24 to 28 degrees C, in which it grows very well. The water pH should be between 6.5 to 6.9. It attains 6 inches in its lifespan. The feed which it prefers most is the prepared feed and also flaked foods, chopped worms. The body of the fish is laterally compressed and the tail is vertically oriented. The fin arises from the top and the bottom. Basically, this fish is omnivore and it lays egg. Pointer fish is also an ornamental fish. The scientific name of the fighter fish is Peta splendens. The common name it is fighter fish. It belongs to freshwater habitat. The optimum temperature in which it grows very well is between 24 to 29 degrees C. The water pH should be between 6.5 to 7.5. The maximum attainable size is about 75 millimeter. It feeds on flaky food, chopped worms, and dry feed. The male fish is noted to be bigger than the female. It is basically omnivorous. They lay eggs, they build the bubble nest, and the male guards the eggs. The most prominent character is the male is aggressive to other males. The next beautiful ornamental fish is Gaurami, which is scientifically called as Colasia. The common name is Gaurami. It lives in fresh water. The optimum temperature for the best survival is 22 to 28 degrees C. The pH of the water should be 6.5 to 7.5. The maximum attainable size of this fish is 50 cm. It feeds on vegetables, algal based flaked foods, chopped worms, and so on. The body of the fish is elongated. It has a ray in front of the pelvic fin. 
is basically omnivorous. It lays egg and build bubble nest. Exhibits a very good parental cap. This gaurabi is basically a mouth feeder. We are going to see the most lovable ornamental fish by most of the people which is called as guppy. The scientific name of this guppy fish is Poicelia reticulata. The common name guppy fish. It is noted to be present in fresh and brackish water. The optimum temperature that is required for the betterment of this fish is 18 to 28 degrees C. The normal pH of the water should fall between 7.0 to 8.5. It attains a maximum size of about 2.5 inches. It accepts all kind of food that is small enough and tries accepts fine flake food. Basically, this guppy fish is an omnivore fish which lives for 5 years. It is a live bearer which give birth to fry once every 2 weeks. Platy fish, which is scientifically called as Psychophorus maculatus, is also one of a beautiful ornamental fish. The common name is platy. It lives in freshwater habitat. The optimum temperature which is suitable for this fish is 20 to 26 degrees C. The water pH should be between 7.0 to 8.0. During the life period, it attains a maximum size of 2 inches. This fish also accepts all kind of food that is small enough. Basically, this platy fish is an omnivore fish which lives for to three years. It is a live bearer which give birth to fry once in every four weeks. To be very noteworthy, the female is larger than the male. And in community tanks, we have to keep two females for every one male. Tiger barb is the next ornamental fish. It is scientifically called as Pantinus tetrazona and commonly called as tiger bar. It will be present in fresh water. The optimum temperature in which it survives well is 20 to 26 degrees C and the water pH should be 6.5 to 7.0. During its lifespan, it attains a maximum size of 4 inches. It accepts all kind of food that is small enough to it. This fish is an omnivore. It reproduces by laying eggs and the male is smaller and slimmer than that of the female. The male is colorful. Widow tetra, which is scientifically called as Kimlocoripius teranatsi. The common name it is tiger bark. It is a freshwater fish. It lives in a medium where the temperature falls between 21 to 27 degrees C and the water pH should be between 6.0 to 7.0. During its life period, it attains a maximum size of about 4 inches. It feeds on all kind of food that is small enough to it. The biology of this fish explains that it is an omnivore fish and the male have a white spot on the body and it is very smaller than that of the female and it lays egg and reproduces. The ornamental fish which looks more colorful is the zebra fish which is scientifically called as Diano Riario. The common name it is zebra fish. It also lives in freshwater habitat. The temperature which is very suitable for this fish to survive is 18 degrees C to 24 degrees C and the water pH should be between 6.0 to 8.0. During its lifespan, it attains a maximum size of 2 inches. This fish feeds on live foods, blood worms, flake foods, etc. The fish is an omnivore fish 
and a cage egg. The male have a gold stripes and the female have silver stripes. It lives on groups and it is a surface dweller fish. So today we have seen about ornamental fishes, their types and characteristics. This beautiful ornamental fishes can be grown at home using an aquarium tank which will help you to develop a hobby and help you to relax your mind and get rid of the stress. This can be commercially grown because it has a very high value and it will help you to become an entrepreneur. Through this video, you would have learned about the variety of ornamental fishes, their types which could be cultured in the aquarium tanks. Thank you.